not sure they spelled wriggling right. But no oh way. <laughs> huh. Oh. Hey. What the? Hey, cool, how are you? Barely play Mario Maker or watch Twitch anymore, but I do have a level. Oh, hey, don't worry about it. I mean, it is the middle of the summer, so I... I have been... Enjoying getting out myself and going out and exercising. What do you got, Bob? And how you doing? Kaizo Camp Bombastic Boomtown. Alright. Really just cool spin drum platforming. Alright. Yeah. By the way, cool, if you're looking for an interesting change of pace type of thing, well, not really change of pace per se, but. I have been streaming Mega Man Maker a bit lately, and that game's a whole lot of fun, too. If you like, uh, Mega Man anyway, and which I do very much. Shit. Not me to do that. Huh. I definitely expected there to be Wigglers in this, based on, okay, it's called... Oh, whirling airship. I wonder if this looks like some kind of Are one-way teleports still a thing in that game? Yup. Even with the 1.4 update just coming out. And with 1.4, some of the, uh, oh, where am I now? I guess. Uh, right, uh, with 1.4 out. They have, um, stuff from, uh, Mega Man 7. Only just, uh, Shade Man and Spring Man so far, sadly. Come on, you. But they have a lot of the level assets. A lot of the level appearances, most of the, I think all the music, uh, uh, what is the word I'm looking for? D made from 8 bit to 16 bit. I mean, 16 bit to 8 bit. And they have a lot of the enemies in there. Actually, the fact that they put Shade Man in doesn't surprise me. That one is a pain in the ass. This was neat, though. <laughs> 